What's up, everybody? This is Titan, Titans of CNC, and I'm here in Flower Mound, Texas. Boom! Just got off the plane from California where we were putting all of the machines on trucks and sending them off to Texas. Now, at this very moment, we got truck after truck after truck making the journey from California to Texas, and in just two days on Monday, it's Saturday right now, on Monday, the trucks will be arriving and we will be putting them in place. Everything's not done with the building. I got special permission from Flower Mound to actually place the machines on the floor right now. And then we're gonna back up, allow them to finish up the offices, and then uh, we'll be ready to go right at the beginning of the year so boom all right uh, let me show you what's going on let's go inside one of the cool things is like every week i'm doing these updates and i'm bringing you guys through this door right here and every week the building is changing and it's happening very quickly and this week is no different like we got amazing things that have happened i'm gonna go a little bit faster this time and just show you what's up and uh think to yourself the state that it's in right now we have trucks coming in two days boom so excited so beautiful now check this out remember the roof you can see all the way to the ceiling Ooh, now there's tiles right black tiles Boom, the lights. Uh, there's gonna be one more coat of paint. Everything's gonna just get fine-tuned and, and all of it. Right there, you got bathroom, bathroom, little kitchen area, and hallway. Right here, you got the glass double doors. We cut open the floor to put electrical here so we could actually bring power up through the desk. It's looking great. So, hallway, now, Here's the office. So this is all glass right here. And then this is a door with glass so that there's light that can come through. And then one of the offices right there. Another office right over here. Inspection over there. And even like our IT room right here. Really cool. The air conditioning inside the IT room. This is where we're gonna have like servers. Of course we have servers, you know, on the cloud and all that. Also, uh, keep everything like legit, right? Right in here. Starting to put some of the cabinets in. Boom, boom. Refrigerator, all that. Coffee maker. Everything's gonna be in here. Ceiling is looking way better. And uh, looking good, right? Looking good. And now when you look in the bathrooms, the bathrooms are like starting to come alive over here. So you can see we got tile on the ground. Boom, we got tile on the walls. All four bathrooms are the same. Now, one of the cool things is like our inspection room. Look at how bright that is right there. In inspection, we just want it to be where we can look and see, you know, inside the pocket, inside, you know, different places. You just gotta be able to see really good, see the parts that you're machining, be able to inspect everything perfectly. But yeah, looking super sick, super awesome. Double doors going out to the main facility out there where the machines are going to be. Ah, what do you guys see? What do you guys see? What do you see? You know what I see? Oh, it's all painted now. Like even the lower parts are painted. We're actually going to do these little um, things to the door. There'll be these little square inserts on the door, like boom, 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 which will be black and stuff. So just keep with the colors. But look, the, the floor looks beautiful. Shop is looking beautiful, crazy. Look, a little mop, a little mop sink right there. The electricity now, just, you know, 400 amps, 400 amps, 400 amps, 400 amps, 1600. It's at 208, because our machines are 208, and we didn't want to, we already had the transformers, we already had what we needed. So we just put the electrical exactly the same as we had it in California. So it'll work over here. You will never see this so empty again, because in two days, I got all the machines coming. I got riggers for the machines. And then I got truck after truck after truck 
Again, we palletized everything. We used eight foot pallets. I rented a forklift because my forklift is in here. And I'm just gonna be going in and actually grabbing every single pallet off the truck, placing everything. Monday, it's going down super beautiful. Ah, oh, the building's looking great, right? Woo, every time we go in, it just looks better and better. Uh, shout out to all the contractors working on the job, um, the property management, everybody. You guys have been absolutely amazing. I want to let everybody know, like, this isn't just like, hey, we're just doing all this. There's a lot of work. There's a lot of intricate details. You just don't put machines on a floor before a building has been signed off because it's brand new, right? You just don't do that. You know, we had to meet, I personally had to meet with the head building inspectors. I had to create a plan. The contractors had to work with, you know, the top fire inspectors, fire marshals, all of that. Make sure everybody understood what the plan was, what was going into the building and uh, what the rules were, right? We needed to have a strategy in place and uh, at the end of the day, literally just Friday, uh, it all got signed off. But uh, you know me, like I push, I push. That's what you have to do in business. And I was just like, when they were saying, well, we're not sure if you can put it on the floor until January 1st. And I was like, I got trucks coming, like I, from a month ago. I have trucks coming, they're gonna be there. And either they're gonna be sitting in the parking lot or they're gonna be in that building. But I'm letting you know, I'm bringing the machines. I'm bringing all my stuff. It's happening before the holidays. So uh, please help a brother out. Oh, and they, it all came together, right? You can't take no for an answer. You got you to gotta work with everybody, but at the same time, you have to do what it takes to make it all happen so that uh, you can get the machines wired up, get them running, you know, and uh, you can just continue the journey, you know? So anyway, just a, just a quick word, all right? You guys have a blessed day, have a blessed week. Love you guys, love this trade. Coming to Flower Mound, Texas to take it all to a higher level, changing our employees' lives. And again, all of our employees are saying employed. 75% are coming to Texas and changing their lives. It is incredible. And in this facility, we are just taking everything that we do to the highest level, new technologies, new machines, everything, all free education for the trade for you guys out there so we can teach you guys how to be awesome at the trades, at machining, at inspection, at automation, and all of it. And we can show companies how to compete in a global market so you can make that money, take care of your families. And that's it. And bring awareness to this trade, right? This is the greatest trade in the history of the world. Let's bring awareness to it. Let's uh, make a shift, get our younger generation excited about it. Boom. All right, now I can go. I'll talk to you guys later. Boom.